welcome everybody back to Rockin' Dr. Rocks and I'm going to be starting a new uh, video series here. We'll give it a try and see how it works. <clears throat> and these are uh, mineral species that I've used my USB microscope to film and I've tried to cut out all the choppy pieces and the things that were out of focus and put together a little video and uh, we'll go through one today see how it works out so be sure and hit the like and share this and let me know if you like this and then I'll try to uh, get others going in here so let me start this uh, video here which I believe is right here and as this plays we're going to be looking at uh, two minerals today azurite and uh, malachite azurite is blue malachite is green I'm sorry, I don't know what this yellow uh, species is in here, but it makes a nice color scheme. Uh, both azurite and malachite are in the monoclinic uh, mineral system. Uh, they are both uh, prismatic in structure. And uh, what we're seeing here with the azurite is uh, primarily either uh, tabular forms of the crystals or rectangular uh, monoclinic, like this, this big ones uh, right here. Uh, so uh, we can, this is a thousand uh, uh, X or 800 to a thousand X somewhere in there. And uh, you can really see fine detail on the side of the crystal face. It looks kind of blurry there. Here's a termination uh, up here. Uh, these are both uh, copper ores. Uh, the formula for azurite is Cu3OH2CO32. And malachite is Cu2OH2CO3. And so they're uh, both um, uh, carbonates and uh, they're usually very beautiful in color. Here, what we're seeing in these green radiating crystals, those are malachite crystals. And malachite is uh, very rare in crystal form. And when it does occur, they're usually in these radiating needles. That's what we see here. Uh, and so you get this great contrast to this deep blue to that green. Uh, here is uh, azurite again. This is a little different sample. Uh, uh, these crystals in here, these are the uh, tabular, uh, possibly prismatic form. And uh, you, know, you can see the beautiful crystal faces and terminations on the ends of the faces. These are kind of, uh, this crystal, uh, they're kind of uh, dull, a little duller. You can d definitely see light glinting off of them, but they're they're not as bright as the deep blue underneath. And they've got this, uh, this kind of a little scale on it, and I'm not sure what that is. That could be a, uh, a carbonate, uh, but I don't want to put acid on it because the azurite's a carbonate as well, and I don't want to etch it. Uh, but it makes a really nice crystal. Again, you can see the very, very uh, structured arrangement of these uh, crystals, uh, the edges and the, uh, that crystal form. Uh, very, very beautiful. It almost looks kind of silvery here with that kind of a duller sheen on it. Uh, here's another portion where you're seeing kind of inside, you know, it doesn't have that dull surface on them and they're, uh, and they're bright blue inside. So you can see the blue inside, that kind of silvery uh, color on it. So very, very uh, beautiful crystals, uh, very, very unique. And these are do form in the Black Hills. Uh, they're not very common, but they're here. And I will be hopefully digging out my samples of this later. Uh, we can take a look at those. So thanks for watching. Give this a thumbs up if you like it. We'll try to do more. See ya.